Hi there. I like watching the Premiership football and if you're in Canada or the US or Spain, like me, for the 2022 season to 23, you might have thought that DAZN was still going to be covering the Premier League. Um, unfortunately, that is not the case. They have lost the license to run the Premier League and that instead has moved over to a new company called Fubo TV. So if you are struggling and looking for your Premiership games on DAZN, now is the time to stop your subscription if the Premiership games were the only thing you were watching. Of course, the problem is that the DAZN service also included some Champions League um, and Euro style games. So there are still games and MLS games if you want to watch those. But if your main focus is the Premiership, maybe you'll do what I did and cancel your subscription as soon as possible with DAZN. Um, it's very disappointing because DAZN for me did provide a very good service. However, we now have to move on to Fubo TV. And so let me quickly show you where you can go to get that and give you some more information about that. So the first thing is if you go to the Premier League website, you'll find that there is a um, a page or that splashes up for you automatically if you're in the right uh, geographical location that will give you that splash screen that says watch the Premiership live exclusively on Fubo TV. Now to be very honest with you I had been getting emails from Fubo TV and literally just deleting them because uh, I didn't know that DAZN were losing the service. So what you would do on the Premiership website is click that get access button um, and or the other thing that you might do is go to the Fubo TV website or it itself and the Fubo TV website looks like this where you have a sign in button at the top and a, or a get access code so you can sign in if you've already signed up of course this is paid access um, and the interesting thing is that um, slightly differently to the zone, which was pure sport, um, Fubo TV does seem to have some other styles of uh, entertainment content as well as sport, but they are uh, right now um, promoting their sport side of things. So um, this is where you can go and it gives you a 42 channel list. And there's two different plans. Now I'm in Canada, so these are Can Canadian prices as of early August 2022. Um, so you can go for monthly, quarterly or annual. I will let you go through those and you would either choose the plan that you wanted. Uh, and in note here, it says there is no free, um, there's no free trial with those particular plans. So you just have to like it or lump it. Um, however, there is iOS, Android, um, Amazon Fire, Roku, Apple TV and Chromecast applications for the Fubo TV app. So if you want to do that, Fubo TV has all of those available for you. And what I'll do now very quickly is give you a clue as to what it might look like on the iOS app. I'll show you my Apple T, uh, my Apple um, phone. So I've literally gone into the App Store, typed in Fubo TV at the top there, and just uh, maybe you can see that. And um, essentially, you will come up with Fubo TV, and you can either download it if you if you haven't, or you just go and get it. And that would be the same on any Google Chrome uh, application as well or Android. And I've yet to discover how to do that on my smart TV, but I'm going to go off and do that later. But realistically, it was all about me letting you know that uh, for the moment, the DAZN service is not available for your Premier League um, watching 
in the areas that I've mentioned, which is Canada, the United States and Spain, you will be looking to go for Fubo TV to replace your Premiership, your Premier League action. May your team do well uh, for the season. My team, I hope, do really well and at least stay up this year. So I look forward to helping you in the near future. Thanks for watching and I uh, hope you found this useful. Bye for now.